प्रणमामि सदा प्रभु पाद पदम प्रणमामि सदा प्रभु पाद पदम शिशि दांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी अगोष्ठी पति Our heart is full of anatha. We are always keeping our door of heart is closed. We are not opening the door of heart open so that sunlight can come. That's why darkness is there. Otherwise, there is no question of darkness. Guru Bargo, Guru Vishnu, always try to give the book gyan. and if somebody can get enlightened by the divya gyan he can see everything who can get siddhi in bhajan somebody asking to prabha who can get siddhi in hari bhajan prabha speaking he can get siddhi in hari bhajan who is in shouta pantha one sentence Who is in South Panta? Never want to make any new philosophy. Nothing. No darshan ek vija. Who is less interested to earn name, fame, nothing? He can get siddhi hundred percent. South Panti, who is going to adopt the South Panta, hundred percent, he can get siddhi. But this Kali Yug is the age of altercation. All is fighting going on. Unnecessary. Unnecessarily, there is fighting going. No reason why fighting going on. This is the arrangement of Kali. Unnecessarily, if you lose your patience, then you cannot do bhajan. You cannot do bhajan. So you will have to keep patience all the time. They like to start fighting with us to stop our Hari bhajan. Don't give answer. One line, two line, I can give answer to them. They cannot give any answer in return. only by logical interpretation only by you know logic we cannot get any success because from mahabharat we know it very well tarko apatishtho sutayu vibhinna nasho munir jasya matam navinyam dharma satyam nihito guhayam mahajano jeno kato sapantya we are advised to follow south pantha mahajano jeno kato sapantha तर्क अपदिष्ट यू कैन नॉट फाइनली सल्यूशन होल लाइफ यू कैन गो ऑन फाइटिंग एंड फाइटिंग एंड ओनली यू कैन गिव एंसर दे कैन गिव अगेन यू कैन गिव एंसर यू कैन ऑल्सो गिव रिटर्न एंसर अगेन दे कैन दिस वे ऑल इन्फिनेटिव यू सो यू कैन लूज योर भजन सो लेट दम बर्क लेट दम बर्क साउट डोंट पे एनी अटेंशन टू देम Don't pay any attention to them. Let them burn. So logic has no base. Logic cannot find any solution. It's beyond logical interpretation. South of Bhag, I mean South of Pantha, is eternally present. We are interested to follow South of Pantha. Let some Acharya speak this and that. Quite natural, Maya Devi, going to arrange, and let thousands of people follow them and go to hell. What is concerned was what to do. Prabhu speaking, he who is busy doing sankirtan twenty four hours, even in dream, he can get success in life. Before accepting anybody as your shiksha guru or diksha guru. it is my request and your lotus feet you try to understand total siddhanta vichar what is the symptom of sadguru emotion is not devotion you are driven by false emotion so uh, you are putting this kind of question so you are putting this kind of question you are driven by emotion is fanatic word as some you know those who are dancing with emotion they are driven by emotion they don't understand what is siddhanta vichar nothing only they like to enjoy lap puja pratishtha glamour they like to get okay that they are getting what else they can expect in their life we are actually dead body we are actually mobile dead body no seva vitti na 
If there is no seva mood, Prabhupada used to say repeatedly, if there is no temperament of seva, then is dead body, mobile dead body. Bhagavad seva, Guru Vaishnava seva is a dharma. Though we know in the beginning we can face some problem, we don't like to do. But that we will have to do 100%, without which no solution. Seva is the symptom of a Chetan Vastu. Seva is the symptom of Chetan Vastu. I mean, those who are interested to do Seva, they are only alive. Bhakti or dead body. Bhagavad Seva is alive. Those who are aversive to this Bhagavad Seva, they are dead body. Krishna, Krasna Seva, Guru Vaishnava, Bhagavan Seva, without which we have no other duty. By Sarup, by Sarup, all Jiva, they are Vaishnava. It is written in Shastra. By Sarup, by, by Sarup, all they are Vaishnava. By Sarup, they are all Vaishnava. That's it. But they, they cannot realize. Chaitanya Bhagavad, Vrindavan Dasta Guru. Keho mane, keho nahi mane, shop Krishna das. Somebody going to confess, somebody not going to confess. But anyway, everybody is, you know, Krishna das. Krishna das. So it is our duty, eternal duty is to serve Krishna, Krishna Krishna. If we are going to utilize our life, if we, if we are going to utilize our life fanciful, feeling, then we can lose our consciousness more and more, more and more, more and more, and we can, spiritually we are dead. Those who are engaged in karmakanda, those who are doing to do some external seva, but inside some desire for love, puja, patishtha, they have no attention towards eternal bhakti. This way, they can never reach that absolute point. They can just waste their time. शिशिदांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी अगोष्ठी पति। If I feel attraction for Maya, for Maya in between, then all gone. That is why we must hear from a living source. Balawan, very powerful sadhu, who is doing all acharan with glad, with very gladly. Is speaking Harikatha, not like lecture, from heart speaking Harikatha. Then, Baba speaking, continuously Harikatha hearing is very, very important. If we can approach a pure sadhu, if there is some political game, some partiality, some love puja patishtha fighting, then uh, you cannot come. You cannot come. You can get lost. Like some foolish people. Passing comment. Why Maharaj not speaking this about these two exalted devotees? He <laughs> foolish. What do you mean by exalted? Eh? After speaking countless harikatha, absolute harikatha, I cannot expect that you can glorify me. I cannot expect. You can, you cannot. That's up to you. I have no expectation. It's foolish question, no? There, is, there can be some divine reason for why he is not speaking so much. Can be some reason. And also, we have so much topics of Prabhupada because it is the instruction of Prabhupada. Guru Padma, you can speak only about Prabhupada. Go on speaking about Prabhupada topics. So all Siddhanta which are speaking about all Prabhupada told. So it is very good. So this question is an absurd question. People are so foolish, they are not Hearing absolute Harikatha. That's why they are putting this kind of question. When there is political game, there is uh, some, you know, fighting issue, you know, love puja, but then this kind of question can. Otherwise, I, I have no right to speak. I have no right to speak you that why you are not hearing me. I have no right to speak. I have no right to speak that you will have to me. Hear me. Why you are not hearing? Thousands of Harikatha. Bengali, Hindi, so many countless Sari Siddhanta writings. Why you are not hearing him? I have no right to speak. I have no right. It's up to you. If Bhagavan 
If you are enjoying some kipa, pure Guru Vishnu, then automatically you can feel attraction. You can feel attraction. Or you can reject me. That's up to you. Some sort of biasness is there. Bias conception is not good. We must try to understand what is absolute, what is not absolute, or what is half portion absolute, 100% not absolute. That you have to understand. With logical interpretation, with fighting mood, you can never come out successful. This spiritual life, the bhajan life is such a sensitive fear where with fighting mood, in infinity period, you cannot come out successful. Fighting is not solution. Altercation, you know, is not solution. Try to understand what is absolute truth. Try to understand. Where from you can get that absolute truth. No party color, no political game should be there. Because it's a question, it is not the question of fighting. It is the question of your survival. Survival of your real self. You are so foolish. You are going to ignore your absolute self-interest. You are going to ignore. And you are going to join one party. That's why you are putting this question. If you are interested about the absolute truth, then you have no scope. Then readily you can understand. Because Prabhupada many times told. Many times, many times Prabhupada used to told, if I seek the path leading to that absolute good, then I must ignore the countless voices of popular wisdom and listen only to that of the realized soul. And realized soul doesn't mean there can be some realized soul from Ramanuja Sambhada, some realized soul can be there. Some Madhu Sambhada can be realized soul. Some Mimbarga Sambhada. So realized soul means, Prabhupada wanted to say, particularly those who are established in the Acharan of Gauranga Mahapu. It's not the question of fighting. It is not the question of fighting because in the very beginning, I wanted to identify myself as the pet dog of my Guru Varga. So where from this fighting can come? I am the pet dog of my Guru Varga. Those who are following Prabhupada exactly, I am going to follow them. Eh? I am the pet dog of Prabhupada. There is no scope of fighting. Because the pet dog always wants to protect the interest of Prabhupada. If there is slightest possibility that if I am not speaking about Prabhupada, then other conception can come and contaminate you. That is my fear. I can speak about so many Acharya, but I am very careful and speaking about Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada in such a way so that you cannot any you cannot develop any misconception. Or if you can develop misconception, then is my your luck is very bad. Luck is very bad. You can complain. When you can find, I am not speaking about Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta Sarasar. You have your right, 100%. But you are not doing that. You have your right to protest me, to chase me, attack me, if I am not speaking about the Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada. If I am speaking about Prabhupada, you have no right to attack me. Because it's complete. Try to understand. If I speak about Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami, it is complete Harikata. It's complete. So you have no right to attack me. But still you are doing. I am very happy that you are feeling some reaction by this Harikatha. Surely, otherwise why should you put this kind of question? This is very positive. I take it very positively, very good. Somebody can believe, believe in manpower, somebody can believe in money power, yet somebody can be there who can believe in Guru Bal, power of Gurudev. So you have no right to fight, simply because you have your money power, you have manpower. So you can attack me, this is not good, no. You can get destroyed, no. Bhagavan, can, I am not going to curse you, I can, I can never become angry. You can do anything with me. I told you many times, if you are speaking against Gauriya Siddhanta, Gauriya Mat, Prabhupada, Gauri Varga, then I become angry. Otherwise, I am not angry. Anything you can, you can beat with your chapal on my head, I am not angry. And I can never, I promise you. But if I find your speech, your writing going to disturb 
going to break down the total system of Sauta Pantha, Guru Parampara, then I can open my mouth like dog. Shout. I can shout. So many Harikatha you are hearing, but you are not going to feel that this absolute truth can change my life. That's why this kind of fighting mood arises. A sadhu cannot be confined with one political level, cannot be confined within a country. A sadhu is international or I can say universal. A sadhu who is taking birth in German, Sadhananda Prabhu, is my father. Not because that he is in German, so I can reject him. He is my father. He is my guru. Maybe he has taken birth in German. But your conception is like a political man. Your conception is dirty conception. It's not good. I have no such prejudicial idea, narrow conception, so that I cannot speak. But when I find some disturbance, you are making some disturbance, going to make some politics, to gather all garbage like La Puja Patishta, I can avoid speaking. So what wrong in it? What wrong in it? Huh? Especially I am going to carry out the order of my Guru Bhat Padma. You must speak about Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. All. So I am speaking. What I can do? And one thing very vital, I started with this point. You should not forget. That Guru Maharaj wants to pull me. Guru Maharaj is there. I can see Guru Maharaj always there with me. Guru Maharaj, Guru Maharaj, Pahupat, always there with me. So I am not feeling any fear. Simply because you can reject me. You cannot hear me. You can throw me out. I can never feel any. Okay, if you are less interested, you don't hear. But I am going to follow the same principle what Prabhupada told me. What is that? If the whole world going against me, try to understand, Siddhanta. If the whole world going against me, still I am not going to stop speaking about that absolute truth, standing under the umbrella-like shelter, Lotus feet of Guru Pad Padma, whole world can go against me. Still, I am not going to stop. Because absolute truth is not such a cheap thing, so that by mass agitation, by manpower, money power, you can come and fight with me to stop my Harikatha. You can try. You can try your best and see the consequence. Future can swear. I can stop. I cannot stop. Even in front of one people is there. I can go on speaking same. In Surya Kundu, in Vrindavan jungle, there there was only one man. Even sometimes no man. I used to speak Harikatha. Continuously. So what did concern to you? You are going to reject me, throw me. I don't care. So I can go on speaking about this. You like to hear, to save yourself, you can hear. Or you cannot hear, that's up to you. I am less interested. Because I don't need any Lap Puja Patishta. I need no Lap Puja Patishta. Only I like to satisfy the Prabhupada. Only I like to satisfy the Prabhupada. This is my target. So you can have some other target. You can follow your target and see what result you can get. And let me follow. Let me follow. Nah? You cannot interfere with my, you know, Siddhanta Bisha. But you can prove that I am speaking lie, then okay. You cannot prove, no. Nah. You cannot prove. So please stop. Many times I told you are not following Harikatha. You are not following, that's why you are going to attack. Many times I told, Narutama Thakuri in Kirtan speaking, Ar kabe nitai chader koruna hoibe. Even one Kirtan, you have no patience, see that one Kirtan of Narutama Thakuri can open and try to understand the meaning of that Kirtan. Whereas you have your time to attack me. That is your excellency. You cannot open. There it is written that when Nithananda Prabhu can become very happy. Ar kabe nitai jate koruna hai. Vishay vasanamar kabe tuchya hai. Ar kabe nitai jate koruna hai ve. Samshar vasanamar kabe tuchya hai. Vishay shariya kabe shuddha habe mon kabe ham herabu sivindha. You are not going to follow. Whereas you have your time 
to attack me, why you are not following that Acharya? I am not bound. I am not going to speak anything against anybody. I am neutral personality. If my father going to speak wrong, I can throw my father. I am in Basasan. In my life, I wanted to throw my father. When he wanted to speak something against me, I throw him. After later on, he changed his mind, mood. But I wanted to throw him. I, I reject him. I cannot see your face. You go away from me. So if I am going to follow this kind of neutral path, even I am ready to throw my father. So how you can speak this way? First of all, to start Hari Bhajan, you will have to stand on a neutral platform, but you are failure. Before starting any type of Hari, any Hari Bhajan, first of all, it is your duty to stand on a neutral platform. No partiality should be there. You should understand what is the perfect Siddhanta. It's not a question of fighting. Question of your survival. You are going to drown in the deep ocean of Maya. You forget it. You forget. You forget this point that you are going to go down and down, life after life. You are not going to take help of your pure, pure Guru Vishnu. Only you are busy with some society, some group, some politics, La Puja Patishta, glamour, this you are. This much you can do. This much you can do. Why not do? Why not do? Why not you check up? Why not you check up yourself that what is the disparity? Of, uh, of of this you know sadhu with that Prabhupada, why not you yourself you why you are not going to take trouble to discover the discovery disparity of that sadhu with the Prabhupada, bhakti siddhanta sir why not you eh? why you try to make the situation hot going to make offense eh bishay vasanamur kabe tuchcha hobe bishay chhariya kabe shuddha hobe mon when all matter, all contamination can go away from my mind. Vishaya Vashanamur Kabe Tuchya Habe. Vishaya Chariya Kabe Shuddha Habe Mon. When I, my mind can become very pure, no contamination should be. Vishaya Chariya Kabe Shuddha Habe Mon, Kabe Ham Hirava Sivindavan. So at all the question of watching Vrindavan, I cannot see Vrindavan. So if I follow the Siddhanta Bichar of Narutam Thakur, Bhakti Vinod Thakur and Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati, you know, eh? then there is no question. No question is see. If somebody is speaking some opposite, then I cannot speak about him now. How I can speak? So it is not my fault. I'm, anyway, I am not going to fight with anybody. I have no time. I can solemnly say, the heart of my Guru Pat Padma, my Guru Pātpada, I have no right to speak. Because what I have done for my Guru Maharaj? That is the main question. It is also one kind of false ego. My Guru Pātpada. My Guru Pātpada. Are you? My Guru Pātpada. How I can say my Guru Pātpada? What I have done for my Guru Maharaj? Anyway, it is my privilege. It is my privilege and advantage that Guru Pātpada give me the scope to identify him as my Guru Pātpada. I am lucky. This way I can say that Guru Padma was so plain hearted, so plain hearted. I don't know how possible. Practically I have seen. I am not making a story in front of you. Guru Padma was so plain hearted. Even one three years boy who has just taken birth is not so simple. 100% in the name of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Gosha, Bhakti Mithaku, or Gauranga Mahapu, Nityananda speaking. Such plain hearted personality in my whole life, I've never seen. One day, Guru Padma speaking, I mean, he want to go to Vrindavan and taking preparation, giving me order, you can, uh, you can all arrange all these books and papers, everything I am doing day by day. Uh, finally, he is asking me, how I can go to Vrindavan? That time his age was 98. He is asking me, how I can go, my son? 98 or 99 over, maybe. I forget. How I can go? I mean, uh, you can go by, uh, by plane. Plane is a huge amount of money. 
I have no money. You check up what is there in my bag. Eh? I, I started laughing. How I can go? I have no money. You check up my bag. Only some... Then I could realize how... When I can reach that level to serve my Guru Parpadam. When I can reach that level, that is called absolute Vaikuntha level, where this kind of simplicity, this kind of plain heart is available. Like the case of Baman Goswami Maharaj. He is going by local train, local means almost local. It's a very rubbish train. You know, rubbish train. It's called, uh, what is called Tufan Express. I also used to go local, this, that, because my life is very simple life. So, Shevak become very angry. Shevak Sri Maharaj, the train is laid by five hours. When we can reach Mathura? You know, it's useless train, Maharaj. Then Bhaman Goswami is speaking, we are very lucky that the train company is going to give us, you know, extra time to take a stay in train and do bhajan. Eh? So why you become angry? Eh? This way Maharaj wanted to indicate that our patience is a great property. Our patience is a great property. What we can do? If we reach Mathura, we can do bhajan. If we are in the way, we can do bhajan. Wherever we are there. That Bhavan Goswami wanted to indicate. Wherever we are. Maybe in the midway. Okay, we can do Hari Bhajan. If we reach Mathura, what we can do? New? New? Something new? No. Hari Bhajan. So same thing. Okay. So there it is our... Uh, you know, we are paying so, you are paying one, we are paying so small amount and they are going to allow us to travel in the train for uh, five hours extra. This is the heart of one pure devotee. This is the heart of one Paramahansa. You know, Bhavan Goswami used to say that I like to die unknown, unseen. Do you think it's a matter of joke? In infinity period you can calculate you can understand what is the mood of that Paramahansa Vaishnava. Only you have your mood to fight. This you can do. This you can do. You can fight. You can come with group. You have money power. That you can do. But you have no power. That infinity period you can get or cannot get. I can. I have no surety. Some of the disciples of Bhaman Goswami wanted to put question in front of me. Why Guru Maharaj wanted to say this way? Long ago, maybe 12, 15 years back, from Punjab, wanted to put. Why Guru Maharaj told this? I like to die unknown, unseen. I man, hear me. Maharaj never wanted to get any pratishtha. Never wanted to get pratishtha. That is the meaning. So, we cannot get any benefit by fighting mood. Rather, we can try to understand sincerely what is the absolute truth. That is more practical, in my opinion. Opinion is Siddhanta. Opinion, my opinion is not opinion. Siddhanta. In Bengali, there is one proverb. One proverb is there. You can kill the snack, but be careful. Don't break your stick. Follow. Shapo morbe and alatio nabhangve. In Bengali. I can follow Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami. I can tell all Gauriya Darshan perfectly. And, and at the same time, I can keep close watch into this matter that so, so that I am not going to break my stick. I can break all opposite Siddhanta. I can break all opposite. I can try to break. At the same time, I am very careful. I am not ready to break my own stick given by Prabhupada, Guru Bhargava. That is very... Now, if you are intelligent, you can understand what I mean to say. शिशिदान्त सरस्वती विजयते गौरी योगोष्ठी पति गौरी योगोष्ठी पति सिसिल भक्ति शिदान्त सरस्वती गुरु समिधकर पहुँचान परमंगस जगत गुरु ट्रोल सिला बिंदाबन दास चकुर महासाय इस डी ओनली गुरु इन आवर गौरी शंप्रदाय व्हाट यू से ओनली गुरु all other gurus, they are not guru. They are guru. But you should remember, Sila Bindaman Dasyakur Mahasaya is the Basa Deva of Gaur Lila. You should not forget. Basa Lila means, Basa Deva means, Bhagavan himself coming 
in the form of Vyasadeva. So, if we can speak this way, there is no problem. Because Prabhupada wanted to indicate, because Prabhupada wanted to indicate Ekayan Paddhati. At present, in the whole world, this kind of conception is rare. Rare men, they don't know. They don't know. Popat wanted to give information to us. We are situation, situated in Guru Parampara. We are situated in Ekayan Padhati. If we are not situated in Ekayan Padhati, then we are deviated from the track of Guru Parampara. Then my Siddhanta become different. All my etiquette, all everything different. So, Ekayan Padhati means we are not going to deserve any credit for any speciality. Whatever kind of speciality you discover in me, but I like to ignore. I have no speciality. Because Papa speaking, all coming from the original source. Who are you? Who are you? Even you cannot realize about, about this, you know, temporary life. This temp life is temporary, not permanent. Unstability of life. If this you cannot feel. But you can feel about Ekan Padhati. So Ekan Padhati means, Prabhupada wanted to indicate all our Guru Varga, those who are really in line with Prabhupada. Repeatedly I told, I have no enmity with anybody. I am not going to criticize anybody. I have no time to criticize. But if I find some Acharya defeated from Guru Parampara, from Prabhupada, Goryamat, I am not bound to speak about him. If you can kill me, still I cannot change. I cannot insult anybody, but I can keep silent. I cannot speak about him. If I find he is just deviated from the track of, you know, Prabhupada, Parampara, then I have my right to keep silence. You cannot put pressure on me. So, Prabhupada wanted to indicate us that Ekan Padhati is the, is the only Padhati. Ekan Padhati way, Ekan Padhati is the only way. So, all our energy, all our resource, all our energy, all our brain, educational qualification, all should be channelized through one authentic channel. That is called unique. Try to follow. All our energy, all our resource, all our educational power, all should be chan channelized through one authentic channel to reach up to the lotus feet of Nityananda. That is called Ekan Paddhati. Because Patishtha, Patishtha is not applicable for me. I am a fallen soul. Maybe I am acting as Acharya, but I am fallen soul. If I am fallen soul, then I have no right to get any Pratishtha. But if I get Pratishtha, it is just like poison. If I am forcefully, you are giving Pratishtha. If I am going to, oh, you are honoring me, so I am big monkey, then gone. It is more than poison. It is more than poison, dangerous. So, Pratishtha, you don't know, maybe you know some Sanskrit word, Prati plus Tha. Tha means with eternally existence. What is eternally existent? The owner. What is eternally existent? It is called Pratishtha. So, Pratishtha, this word is only applicable for Nityananda. Not for you and me. Or at all, if you can say those who are staying unto the lotus feet of Nithananda, for them not applicable? Yes, for them applicable. Those who are, those who are established in the lotus feet of Nithananda, they are also non-different from Nithananda. So it's applicable for them, but not for you and me. Or maybe for you, not for me. Who can say? So Pratishtha, is applicable for Nityananda and or, or those who are Guru Bhargava, those who are actually falling. No contamination of La Purja Patishtha going to contaminate heart. Nitai Charan Sattva, you heard this Kirtan. 
নিতাই চরণ সত্য তাহার সেবক নিত্য নিতাই চরণ সদা কর আস নিতাই চরণ সত্য দ্য লোটাস ফিট অফ নিতান ইটারনালি প্রেজেন্ট অ্যান্ড দোজ হু আর রেস্টিং ইন দ্য অন দ ইন দ্য লোটাস ফিট অফ নিতানন্দ লোটাস ফিট দে আর অলসো নিতাই চরণ সত্য তাহার সেবক নিত্য দোজ হু আর সার্ভেন্ট অফ নিতান দে আর ইটারনালি প্রেজেন্ট নেতাই চরণ সাদা করো আস সো বিফোর্স পাসিং এন সিদ্ধান্ত বিচার উই শুড রিমেম্বার হোয়াট ইউ আর স্পিকিং হোয়াট ইউ আর স্পিকিং ইউ শুড রিমেম্বার বিকজ ইফ ইউ আর স্পিকিং সাম সাচ সিদ্ধান্ত বিচার উইচ ইজ জাস্ট এগেনস্ট আওয়ার পরম্পরা আওয়ার গৌড়ীয় সিদ্ধান্ত দেন টুডে আর টুমোরো মে বি হান্ড্রেড ইয়ার্স আফটার who can say who can say then people can realize gradually because to realize the absolute truth is not so easy thousands of jivatma can come unto the lotus feet of guru path padma but who can say who is going to enjoy actual kripa who is going to get actual dibbo gyan who can say no guarantee simply by this calculation simply by this kind of calculation that he is enjoying too much favor all over the world he is enjoying so much you know he is having so much temple so much disciple this is not the document whereas you cannot find one you cannot find even one disciple of gaur kishor babaji maharaj because gaur kishor babaji never confess that bimala prasad is my disciple in this sense though we know Bimala Prasad took Diksha from him, but he don't convey, I have no disciple. And no disciple, no Pratishtha, no temple, nothing. That doesn't, that doesn't mean you can say that he is useless. This is not the documents. Many temples, many disciples, many ma so much money, this is not the document. Foolish people, they are misguided this way. So, নিতাই চরণ সত্য তাহারও সেবক নিত্য নিতাই চরণ সদা করো আস ইফ উই আর গোয়িং টু ইগনোর গুরু পরম্পরা গুরু বাদ বদ্ম ইফ ইউ আর গোয়িং টু ইগনোর আওয়ার নিত্যানন্দ প্রভু গুরু ইফ আই ইফ আই ইগনোর ইফ আই ইগনোর মাই গুরু পাদ পদ্ম দ্যাট মিন আই এম গোয়িং টু ইগনোর গুরু পাদ ইফ আই এম গোয়িং টু ইগনোর গুরু পাদ পদ্ম দ্যাট মিন আই এম গোয়িং টু ইগনোর নিত্যানন্দ প্রভু I am going to ignore Nityananda Prabhu. Be careful. Before insulting one pure Guru Vaishnava, before you know, speaking anything against Guru Vaishnava, you must be careful. You can get destroyed. Totally can destroy. All finish. If you want to invite destruction in your life, if you want to invite destruction in your life, that you can do. You can fight with pure Guru Vaishnava. You can fight against Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta, Sasri, Goryam. That you can do. Otherwise, don't do. Don't try to take this kind of risks. Be careful. First of all, Prabhupada wanted to rectify our dirty heart by saying, be it sure that Vrindavan Das Chakur Mahasai is the only Guru in our Gauriya Sampradaya. Gauriya Sampradaya. By this word, Prabhupada wanted to say, that we must be in we should be we must be in in ekayan padhati we never want to get any pratishtha whatever speciality you find in me maybe i don't find any speciality in me all i am doing by the power of that basadeva bindavan das chakur mahasaya by bhakti vinod chakur pohupa so where from the question of taking any pratishtha from me even i have no right to take any garland from you garland you can give to vasudeva whatever we are writing what we are speaking by the causeless mercy of bindavan das guru mahas who am i who are you even kishnadas kubiraj goswami going to catch the lotus feet of bindavan das guru mahas i am going to cry please you know please you try to bless me i have no audacity i have no audacity to represent gauri of philosophy gauri of siddhanta gauranga mahapur vichar by ignoring you whereas 
I am as an Acharya going to ignore all the Siddhanta Vijaya Prabhupada, Bhakti Mir Thakur. We are going. This is my speciality. This is my speciality. That I can make full of, I can make full of people all over the world. This speciality I have. No other speciality. Any kind of desire there inside heart, bondage. But if desire is pure desire, you will like to exp you will like to expand, propagate pure devotional you know, Siddhanta. That is not Annavilas. That is not under the category of Annavilas. If I want that everybody should know the Siddhanta which are of Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta Sar and Bhakti, this is not my Annavilas. This is not my Annavilas. But when I am speaking something self-interest about me, 100% is Annavilas. It's Annavilas. So, there should not be any particular, there should be any ism, nothing. You should stand on a neutral platform to understand what is good, what is bad, what is Siddhanta, perfection, what is wrong. It's a question of your survival. Survival of your real self. It's not the question of fighting, you can come and we can start fighting. Foolish people. Life going, why we are playing. Life going, we are playing, life going. We are playing. These are in a condition. So, Bindaban Dastaguru Masa was not given any place and position by those material society. He was insulted. He was insulted, thrown out. Huh? Bindaban Dastaguru was insulted by those of the material Brahman. Why? He wanted to establish Siddhanta Vishal. That is his fault. What is my fault? You find many fault you can find. But one of them is uh, that I want to speak about Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddham. That is all. So Bindavan Dasagur Mahasa has thrown out of that Brahman society. We don't confess. And not only that, but also they started speaking all rubbish against Bindavan Dasagur Mahasa. They started speaking all rubbish against Vrindavan to, to to speak all rubbish, dirty thing. About Vrindavan Dasyagurma and Narayani Devi, they wanted to start speaking. But still, though Vrindavan Dasyagurma was, uh, he was put aside by all Brahmans, but still, he was not ready to change even one single Siddhanta Vishal. Just not ready. Better you can kill me. I am not going to change. So when you can find that all Siddhanta Vichar, Acharan, everything was implemented by one Acharya in practically. Practically, not impractically. Then you can understand his eternal parsat. See Chaitanya Manabhishtam Sapitam Jena Bhutale, what Manabhishta wanted to establish. You are guided by false emotion. That's why you are going to invite total destruction in your life. Why you are going to fall? There is no, no, no place of emotion, false emotion. You are going to invite, simply because of that. First of all, you should stand on a neutral platform. That is a symptom upon Vaishnava. How you can understand one pure Vaishnava? How you can understand a pure Vishnu? You should remember one symptom of pure Vishnu is neutral, is neutral. He eh? is always neutral. Not going to follow. Neutral position is going to maintain and uh, all is going to speak all about the absolute truth. Absolute platform, nirapekkata, shatata, you know, this. All these are the symptoms you can understand. Then you can. If somebody is going to speak something different, then he is not neutral. Saralata, dirata, nirapekkata. You should remember. 
if you can remember and apply it practically in your life, you can arrest so many people. Bengali, I am speaking, saralata, simplicity, dhirata, rigidity. Saralata, dhirata, niropekhata, neutral position. Until and unless you are standing on a neutral platform, you cannot maintain the second quality, I mean. That is called rigidity, strong rigidity. You cannot maintain, not possible. Follow. Because there can be some love puja patishta can make you you. Some slight nobody outside people so fully they cannot they cannot understand. But pure pure Vaishnava, they can look at him, his activities, his speech, immediately arrest. Pure Vaishnavas, they are elevated if they watch one Acharya, walk, watch his activities. And hear one or two words, immediately they can arrest. It's kapat. It's not in line. But you cannot understand. You cannot understand. So three qualities you should remember. To understand a pure Vaishnava. Otherwise you don't confess. There is a way. Maybe the whole world can give. Majority must be granted. There is a material formula. We are not in favor of this formula. So, Saralata, simplicity. Simplicity mean? Simplicity mean? What is there inside her? He is speaking. Not going to, for love puja, but going to speak a half truth. Not speaking. He is speaking half truth. Going to conceal something. Papa speaking to conceal the truth is a great offense. He conceal the fact. Siddhanta Vija is a great offense. Those who are doing, they can get severe punishment. Severe punishment. How many prayer by the infinity pure? As per Sastra. As per Sastra, it is speaking, like mathematics, you can come, don't fight, you can sit, I can prove. Like mathematics. Jo Bhakti Nairohitam, who is speaking all opposites, is not Siddhanta. Not say wrong, totally wrong Siddhanta. Jo Bhakti Nairohitam, Annayana Sinatija, To Ubhav, To Ubhav, Brajataha Nirayam Kalam Akshayam. In Sastra, it is written. Those who are speaking wrong Siddhanta, those who are hearing wrong Siddhanta, both the group, he and he, all his followers, they can go to hell for infinity period. It is written in Sastra. So, Siddhanta Vichar, Siddhanta Vichar is not a matter of gymnastic feats. I can get the barbell to make the muscle half. The Siddhanta Vijaya is not gymnastic feats. Siddhanta Vijaya is not gymnastic feats. I can get some barbell and iron and make. It's automatically. If you are in line with Guru Bhargava, I promise you in Basasan, though if you are illiterate, but still Siddhanta, you can speak right. It's not a question of knowing Sanskrit, grammar, this, that, philosophy, Vedanta, not there. Eh? What you can expect with Gorkishar Bhajima? Gorkishar Bhajima never speak wrong Siddhanta. Never, because he is in line. So, if somebody wants to transgress, overlook, you know, insult, then no chance. It's Siddhanta Bhajima. So, simplicity mean, simplicity mean, Straightforward. Simplicity, simplicity means straightforward. Simplicity means aprakita smartness. Hey, you can go mad, I can prove. Simplicity, simplicity means aprakita smartness. Straightness is equal to smartness. Because in Kirtan we find antare bahire samabhavahar amani manadahavu. Antare bahire samabhavaha. Not that you are coming, I become, I like to hide myself. I am going to behave with you in a very uh, different way. Kapat. Kapat. What is there inside my heart? That I am speaking. That is called Saralata. All nice definition of Saralata is to stay in line with Guru Varga. It's more practical. Saralata mean? Saralata mean? You have no right to play your brain. 
Nothing. Saralata means if you are in line with Guru Bhargava, then you are, if you are in line with Guru Bhargava, automatically you are straightforward. Only automatically you can show smartness. Automatically you can get everything. So, Antare Bahire Samabhavahar Amani Manodhava. Try to understand the scientific vichar. Antara Bahire, first of all, who is in line with Guru Bhargava? Antar, what is there inside my heart? Uh, what I heard from Guru Varga and speaking the same. And when you can speak, when you can speak about Siddhanta Bichar, same Guru Varga, when you, there is no desire for La Puja Patishta. So, what is speaking? Antare Bahire Samo Vyabhahar. Amani Mano Dhabha. Amani means, I need no honor, no Pratishta. Mano I can give honor to you. I can give honor to you. But at present, this society can prove wrong way. They can say, they can say we are giving honor to somebody. Why he is not giving to honor to somebody? They can say. So I like to cover up all in a loop soul. Surely I am not going to give garland to Kangsa. So you can, it is your privilege. You can say Maharaj is not going to give honor to. It is your privilege. But surely I am not going to give, give garden to Kangsa to make any compromise. Surely I am not going to give garland to Hiranyakashipu, Hiranyakho, Shishupal, Dantabarka, Chapal Gopal. I cannot give. Even not to Sarvabhuma, if he is not in line with Gorangamap. Now he is in line with Gorangamap, I can give garden to him. So I understand my Siddhanta Vija. So if you can indicate Maharaj not giving honor to anybody, you prove me. If I am not giving honor, how I am gi giving honor to Guru Varga? Because regarding glorification of Guru Vaishnava, it is written in Sastra, if I myself don't love them from heart, I cannot glorify them. The Siddhanta Visha. From heart, if I am not going to love my Guru Varga, I cannot memorize some Siddhanta and speak in front of you. That means I love my Guru Varga. Like the case, if you, you yourself is not Bhagavat, then you have no right to touch Bhagavat. Follow. If, if yourself is not Bhagavat, you are not Mahabhagavat, then you have no right to speak about Bhagavat. If you are yourself not Vaishnava, you cannot glorify other Vaishnava. Automatically, mathematics. It's like mathematics, like mathematics. If yourself is not Vaishnava, you have Lapu Yapadishta, never you can glorify. Never. Whatever proficiency you can have, whatever you know, maybe you are an erudite scholar, but still you cannot do. Because it's not the question of you know speaking, oratorship automatically come. So somebody can complain, oh, I am not giving honor to somebody, nobody else. Yes, I'm not giving honor, but I am giving honor to Vaishnava. Not to Kangsa. If one Acharya is there, he is Kangsa. Bhagavad, same Chaitanya Bhagavad there in front of me. I can die if I speak lie. I can give honor to actual Acharyas. I cannot give honor. He can throw me, reject me. I cannot give honor to Kangsa. The Prabhupada told. I learn everything from Prabhupada, Bhakti Thakur, Guru Varga. I am not ready to learn anything from you and your society. Boba speaking. Boba speaking this Siddhanta. To honor, to honor the maternal uncle of Krishna, ah, he is, he is a maternal uncle of Krishna, Kansa. So let us give garland to Kansa. Boba speaking, you foolish. <laughs> Idiot number one. Boba speaking. It is your basic fault to understand that Kangsa is the maternal uh, uncle of Krishna, so let us give one garland. I cannot give garland to Kangsa. So you can start agitation. But you cannot discover that I am not giving garland to our Guru Varga. You cannot discover. All the moment I am doing Arati, all fraction of second. Doing Arati of Prabhupada, Bhakti Unit Thakur, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Krishna Thakur Prabhupada. So you have no right to put any force on me. 
cannot put like political leader, political party. It's not political level. Why not you go and join political party? You can make prosperity there in the line. Why you come? Why you come and acting as a chari? You are going to take yourself in the hell for infinity period. Hundred percent, hundred, hundred percent, hundred, hundred percent. You are going to, you are going to take your yourself in hell forever. You are enjoying now, love puja. Okay, enjoy. How long? Life is limited. You can live maybe up to sixty-five, seventy, or eighty, or hundred, maybe. After that, after that you will have to think, na. After, after that you will have to think, now what you can get. If you are foolish, your eyes you can still, your eyes by these eyes you can see woman, man, handsome man, beautiful lady, or you can see stool, urine. This you can money, pojini. But your eyes is so dirty. You cannot achieve that kind of fine darshan. Follow what I say. It's so, it's interrelated. Antarya bahire samava. So three formula. Three formula you should remember. What is that? One Vaishnava, Shara, very straightforward. No, Guru Padma is like child. Well, more than a child. More than a child I cannot speak. I feel shy to speak. How much simplicity, since simplicity was there in Bhakti Bhumatulga? I cannot speak. Any amount of philosophy, any amount of word is not sufficient. I've seen. I started laughing inside. Oh, it's so simple. Even one child can, you know. So he is Saralata. He never wanted to make any compromise with Siddhanta Vichar. He never wanted to make any Siddha, even in old age. Old age, hundred years. Ah, no, that, that time he was uh, 98 years. They give us, give me responsibility for editing. One writing came from Vindavan. One writing came from Vindavan. Govardhan, I was there in Govardhan. Just Govardhan, no, I was there. In the, in the rooftop, so much hot, 48 degree. All water, low, whole body red. No place for me. I'm a beggar, so I was bound to stay there. I was bound to stay. In the winter season, I used to say in a naked ground, totally wind, 8 degrees, one sack of, you know, potato, down, sitting here. This is my life. So if you kill me, so this is not a big problem for me. I have seen the naked picture of this society. You cannot make fool of me. Follow. So, Guru Padma, very simple. Very simple, simplicity. And Guru Mahaj wanted to reject that, that so-called sannyasi, Acharya, he always wants to prove that I am a big. He always wants to prove, big Acharya. He is writing Sanskrit, right? so many. He writing, he sent some writing, Guru Mahaj reading, Guru Mahaj, I saw Guru Mahaj, you read this, it's okay or not, please you read, can have a look. Guru Mahaj, read there. No, I said that is not good. So, See, see. Even Guru Mai heard who wrote this letter. Who wrote this? After that, no, no, no. This is not good. So, first point, Guru Mai was very simple. Second point, rigidity was there. He never wanted to confess all wrong Siddhanta regarding Rasa Tattva, anything. On the contrary, he wrote some, so many things. I can show you. If you attack me, I can show you Guru Mai wrote it. Popat wrote it, Bhakti Mataguru, how you can attack me? Cannot attack me? He, they told me. I am their dog. I am speaking. So, Saralata, Dhirata, Rigidity, and Nirapeksha. If you are not standing in neutral form, whatever big Acharya you are, you are going to fall down in the hell. First qualities of an Acharya. First quality, the first and foremost quality of an Acharya is to maintain simplicity, rigidity and, and neutral position. First. Otherwise you cannot give protection to Siddhanta Bani. Otherwise you can never give protection to Siddhanta Bani. Otherwise you can never give protection to Siddhanta Bani. Not possible for you. Whole world can run behind you. What is concerned to me? 
You cannot protect. And if you cannot, if you cannot protect Siddhartha Vichar, then surely you are not Acharya. If you are unable to protect Siddhartha Vichar, Guru Parampara says, then you are failure. You are not Acharya. Automatically, like mathematics. Absolute truth is always bitter. Absolute truth is always bitter. If you are speaking, you can try to beat me. It's quite natural. Absolute truth is always bitter. Absolute truth is not sweet. Apparent not sweet. Bitter. But after that, you can get the taste of. But previously you cannot. But in Gita we know, Jadagre Amritapamam Pariname Bishamiva. What is very testy in the beginning, but finally poison. Gita, in Gita, you can find. Jadagre Amritapamam Pariname Bishamiva. He is the standard. One pure Vaishnava there, you're going to throw him outside. Oh, we have no connection with you. We have our Vaishnava society, we can. You stay alone. Because why? Why Popad was attracted by Sahaja? Why? What wrong Popad done? There is a fault in his character? Anything? But they he wanted to beat, kill Popad. Simply because Popad wanted to speak about that absolute truth. So they don't like to hear that absolute truth. In the name of bhajan, in the name of bhajan, if you like to make some compromise with some sahajiya, then you cannot stand. Hari bhajan is not, Hari bhajan is not so so cheap. Hari bhajan is not so so cheap that you can start. So Bindavan Das Thakur Mahasaya is rejected by that whole society, but still. Bindavanda Thakur never wanted to change any Siddhanta Vichara. In the great assembly, Mamad, Mamad gathering, the great assembly, Mamad gathering, there, Mamad gathering, there are thousands of people hearing the Harikatha Prabhupada. There was a fighting between two topics. Brahman is more important than Vaishnava, or Vaishnava is more important than Manma. Or uh, what is the amicable solution? Follow. For seven days, continuously, Pope was discussing. And the great disciple, as you know, is sitting, you know, is in Bakrashar Pandit line. Vishamarananda Dibgu Goswami. Vishamarananda Dibgu Goswami, the great disciple. In the line of Samananda Bhav, he was there. He gave uh, he is requesting Prabhupada, Bhimala Prasad, you can see. That time Prabhupada was Bhimala Prasad. Took the blessing of Bhakti Mahatma Thakur, Bhakti Mahatma Thakur expressing Leela, this kind of Leela. Sananda Sukhata Kunj. Follow. Taking the kipa, Bhakti Mahatma Thakur bless him, you go. You go, no problem. Because Bhakti Mahatma Thakur was supposed to go, but cannot go due to his sickness. So, Popat wanted to explain and the reason for why I am going to speak these topics, thousands of people hearing with full attention, so pop, Popa standing in the you know, platform like fire, body fulgence coming. One Vaishnava, if you can look at Vaishnava, you can see so power, body fulgence coming. All people, they are hypnotized. They are mad, gone mad. All they like to take shelter onto the lotus feet of Prabhupada. All they. One leader, one leader from the committee member, one leader from the committee member, they organize the Sova, the assembly. They are coming, very important person, according to their, according to their estimation. It's very important, it's coming, Prabhupada. One request. They all like to they all like to take shelter onto a lotus feet. Only you will have to make some compromise. They are taking sometimes tea, 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 you know. They are taking tea, sometimes bitter leaf. Oh, you have to compromise. No. Papa said, I can, I don't like to get even one disciple. What to speak about thousands of people? Even one disciple I don't like. I'm not coming here to make disciple. So you understand, no? Now no nobody there. Standing on such a neutral platform. They like to increase the number of monkey. Increase the number of monkey. And monkey increasing. You show me. You show me Dibbogan. 
Oh, what to speak, show me. You yourself can prove that you have the Bhagavan. I am not speaking about your disciple. You prove that you have your Dibhagan. Excuse my adversity. I am speaking about the absolute truth. You prove that you have Dibhagan. Even you cannot prove. How to? So you are increasing number of monkeys who can jump from one tree to another tree. Whole world. That you are increasing. You show me one who can understand Prabhupada, Bhakti, Siddhanta. You show me. You show me, you make one disciple who is 100% in line with Popa, then I can confess. You cannot show. Because you are failure. Mayadevi giving you success. Mayadevi giving you success, but Bhagavan not giving you success. Mayadevi giving you success. Success I know. But Bhagavan not giving you success. It is not success. It is not success. शिशिधांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति